Here's a simple way to set Project North and True North to be working correctly. First of all, make sure you understand that in your visibility settings, there is something over here called Project North and True North. When you're working on a drawing, uh, you probably should have started out, the, the default is to start out drawing in Project North. Project North basically is up on the pages north. So what you want to do is go into your site plan and in visibility settings, make sure that the site under site, sorry, that the survey point is turned on. Okay? So make sure that's turned on. And then here you have your Project North. This is the project that I'm working on. Then you import your surveyor's drawing, and it'll be at whatever orientation um, that it comes in at. I've already done this to save a little time. And then you just select the thing and rotate it so that it's pointed, so that North is pointed in the same direction as Project North. This is the only reason to do this is to get the thing oriented straight so you can figure out what the difference between Project North and True North is. Okay, so I you don't see this, but in this drawing, this is the outline of the building I'm working on. That line is Project North going that way. Whatever yours is, do it. And this line is True North. The angle between them is 47.94 degrees. If I want to rotate, and it's going to ask me, what's the difference between True North and Project North? Remember, clockwise is positive. It's negative between True North and Project North. It's negative 47.94, but it's not going to let you enter negative numbers. So you have to go negative, or I'm sorry, you have to say 360 minus 47.494 equals 312.506. All right, so having said all that mumbo jumbo, there's two interesting symbols you want to look at. If you take your, if you don't have any of the crop views, none of these are checked, so there's no cropping. There's these two icons that appear. One is the survey point, and one is the site project base point. This is not the one you're interested in, but it, it's interesting. So you click on it, and you click on the, the word survey point. And under location, you can enter the address of the project, and that'll give you all the um, solar angles and stuff will turn out right. Then instead, go to this site project base point and click on it. And over here on the side, it says angle to true north. So that number that I just said, 300 and 12 degrees, 0. 0.506, apply. OK, now I'm ready to take the site plan that I imported and rotate it so that it actually is in the right orientation. So I'm going to rotate this, place the angle spinner, and I want to rotate the view that's here so that it's actually now facing project north. Okay, so this and this are the same. And since they're at the same scale, I don't want to waste time with it now. I could overlay them one on top of the other. But the point is now, if I this is project north, and then I go to true north and give it a second. And see now true north is this is true north. This is project north. And we're all set up. And now this is Project North. Ain't that sweet?